Uh, GFP is a wonderful example of a lot of different uh, things radiating out from uh, an initial discovery. And while, yes, I am proud of those things, I think it, that's, they're quite wonderful. Um, but I think it, there's uh, an aspect that I, I hadn't really realized that when we did the work that there's a, a little bit of um, people saying to themselves, oh, why aren't we looking at X or why aren't we looking in this other place? So I think that uh, especially when Mats and Lukianov and, and others discovered that corals had red fluorescent proteins, all of a sudden now people are going, we're going out and saying, what other fluorescent organisms are there? Where have we, why aren't we looking at all of these other possibilities? And there's been a wealth of things found in many different organisms from this. It was sort of like giving permission. Oh, there's something else to look at. Things that may have been around us all the time that we didn't know about, that all of a sudden there's a whole new world to, to, that opened up. And, and worked on. And I think that in general, the, this has changed the way people, uh, what they look at. And I think one of the things you know, I, I feel uh, for myself and others is uh, you know, sometimes there's something right in front of us that we have been looking at all our lives and we don't realize what an interesting question it is. I, I, uh, I give a, a, a general seminar uh, for students and uh, one of the things I say to them is uh, the first experiment I ever published on, my first publishable paper, was looking at the transparent part of the body. And I then asked the audience, I said, no, say it. But if you know what the transparent part of the body is, raise your hand. And about 5% of the people in the audience will raise their hand. And then I say, look, I'll give you a hint. It's right in front of your eye. And all of a sudden, everyone says, oh yeah, the cornea. I've been looking through that my entire life, but hardly anyone has ever asked themselves this question. How is it possible for this tissue to be transparent, to let the light into our eye? And so I think that there are these questions all right us, and what you need is that little stimulation that suddenly, oh, look at all these different ideas and areas that we can go into. And uh, it's, been, it's been very wonderful that GFP has allowed that to happen.